So we formed the Hemp Association, and basically we want to be seen as the umbrella organization for anybody who wants to deal with cannabis per se, whether it be cannabis sativa, industrial hemp, or cannabis indica, medicinal marijuana, you come through us. Um, and we, we intend to be an advocate, one of the key advocates of which we are. We've, um, we've joined the coalition of various other civil society organizations, such as the um, West Africa Drug Policy Network, uh, the International Drug Policy Consortium, and, and various other organizations as well. So we're a part of this group. And first and foremost, we're pushing at the hemp. Uh, I see the battle as two-pronged. You know, the word legalization shakes the country because they think it conjures up images of people just walking around smoking weed. You know, the, the fragile nature of someone else's mind in their head, you know, conjures all these things up. So they get scared. You know, and then you've got doctors who also add to that fear by talking about uh, cannabis inducing psychosis, which it can't on its own. And uh, with alcohol being the biggest killer, killing 300,000 Ghanaians every year, and it's a legal drug, no one seems to blink an eye, eyelid about that. Cannabis doesn't kill anybody and hasn't recordedly killed anyone in Ghana since independence and probably beyond but no one not is aware Ghana. no one no one is aware of that yeah not just Ghana no one is aware of that so I'm focusing on the hemp because the the hemp is an antipsychotic plant contrary to what people believe um, there's nothing psychotic about it it doesn't have significant traces of THC to make one feel high or euphoric or you know any of these things it's been wrongly classified since way back when and um, we've adopted the law and wrongly classified it here as a brother was saying earlier they had the stuff in their hand but they don't read you know this is a classic too they have, you'll see them with all these documents but they don't read anything um, if it has something to do with money they read that section and the rest of it they don't know anything about. So we're working on declassification um, as a first prong attack. Um, and so the Hemp Association has off takers in Portugal, people who will supply the seeds. And they provided us with the lab report on the seeds they will provide. And we engaged the Food and Drugs Authority about it and said, look, We've got our off takers, they're going to take all the hemp that we can produce. Uh, hemp is, is not uh, illegal, or it shouldn't be illegal. Um, and we know uh, the content of what this hemp contains, which is 0.03, which is just a trace of THC. It can't do anything. And hemp specifically comes with no THC. So there's no reason for hemp to be illegal at all. Everybody should be able to grow hemp. And the key the thing the key thing about growing hemp is there's over fifty thousand uses for it. It can make all the clothes you're wearing and I and the bedroom and the furniture, it can build a house, there's hemp cream. Um, it can build a car, it's stronger than steel. Um, it can provide the fuel for the car and the fuel for the plane because it can make the aeroplane as well. And of course you get the C B D oil from it which is good for a number of, of elements and you also you get hemp seed oil you know depending how you want to do it with your crop um, so there's no reason at all why it should actually be deemed illegal so we're hitting them that direction first but we know the main discussion is going to be about the medicinal marijuana and we're prepared for them on that but first of all we're going to make them bow and concede to the fact that it shouldn't be classified as such. So we need to remove it from the Narco Bill 2019. Uh, I don't think it will pain them um, once they really understand understand that people don't smoke hemp. You know, it's not for smoking. Um, 
So I think once they understand that aspect and we put that over nationally, then I think everyone will be calm. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So we'll be able to do that. So that's we're moving along finally with that because we've got a meeting lined up with the Parliamentary Select Committee on uh, Interior and Defence. And uh, when that happens is when we'll formally submit that. We've spoken to them, the members informally, they know it's coming. They know they can't stop it. They know it's more than reasonable. In fact, they know it's a fact. So there's... They know. They know. Fact. Yeah, so they, they know, know it's a fact. They know that the plant hemp is different from the plant. Yes, marijuana. yeah, they know, they know. We've educated them to that, to that extent. So we'll do that. And then I take it as read that they'll carry that in their report to cabinet that look, this shouldn't be there. And we can push them further. We can grow some. Yeah? Because I've now sent for the seeds from Portugal and I'm awaiting the seeds to arrive. And when the seeds arrive, we're going to grow some. And then we'll call the police. So have a look at that. They don't know marijuana from a red rose. So all weed be weed for them. So when they see it, that's weed. So they'll arrest us. They'll take down some of the crop. Um, they'll arraign us before court. We'll go to court. It was charged. You were growing a narcotic. Da, 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 da. No problem. We all know what you've got to do then. You've got to test. So we'll go and test you. We'll, we'll wait for you and come back. Because we'll get bail, no, no big deal. We'll get bail, so we'll continue with what we're doing. When they test it and they come back to us, they will know that there's no THC in it. Because these are not Ghanaian seeds. These are seeds from abroad, which we've already attained a lab report for. Yeah, so we know that it is worth planting. Then they themselves are going to have to throw out the case, and that will officially declare that. And it's not illegal. So that is your blueprint. Right? That is the way you plan to. Uh... Two ways in one. Yes. Yeah. And it's running simultaneously. I'm waiting for.